In this video, I'm going to show you how to get multi-channel capability in modes besides multi-channel. It's hinted in the manual, and I did some experiments, and it seems to work. I have the synth in unison mode. Now, it says that A, B, C, and D can be used in multi-channel for creating a different attack to case, same release. I'm going to try that. So I'm going to start up. I've already got D, because that will be whatever the, anything else is. So I'm going to go to C. I'm going to bring the attack up and decay up and the glide up. And on B, I'm going to pull it down to a short attack, a short decay, bring this about to a moderate glide. An A will be very short attack decay and a really low sustain and not much release. Let's see what it sounds like. Now this is where the uh, detune is very important. Well, that's way too much, but th about there is about right. And now I've got the effects on. This synth is the uh, Ramona 14, the high-pitched one. And this, of course, is the Abyss. Now, one caveat about this, how you pronounce it, is that uh, if you turn it off and you're in A, B, C, and D mode, you may get no notes. I'm going to do that. Go click. Back on. Let's see what I get. No, you still get something, but I think it defaults to one of these four. So you just go back, and that will reset it. So you never, you have to set this every time you want it. And I generally start the synth in the G mode, and then B, C, uh, D, C, B, and A. Anyhow, have a good evening. Bye now.